Uh, well, you're very welcome, everybody. Um, today is a big day, big day for all of us. Uh, and that I <laughs> am revealing <laughs> to you, I am gifting you all <laughs> with uh, the, the Minecraft creation that I've been making. Uh, and I'll be showing you something that I've kind of kept secret from um, from arms here for about um, uh, for about well three or so years. He's got he caught a glimpse of it like three years ago. I think I showed you a small bit of it. Yeah, uh, it, was, it was yeah on a laptop like somewhere at some point, maybe in Edinburgh. But um, but he's never seen it. Uh, I ne I never showed him it like uh, for the three years after or so. And I've been like, plowing away at this one game, this one saved game for three and a half years. Now you'll see the entrance to my, so you've, I think you saw this kind of, um, this roller coaster thing at one point. I think you did see yeah, that. Yeah, no, I did. I mean, I saw a lot of this place and it looked deadly when I saw it. Like, okay, yeah. Again, I think you, you many saw years ago. This roller coaster was the rail, yeah, it goes up and then it goes down and it goes down into this glass tunnel, which I built. <clears throat> and then goes along here. And of course, it's this beautiful little entrance here that I built. So there, ha <laughs> uh, So, so you see the old, uh, Kind of uh, obviously, uh, Lord of the Rings inspired entrance to the avenue there, as you can see, uh, Armsy. Um, oh yeah! Ah, yeah. deadly. <laughs> there he is. There he's seen it. There he's seen it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So as that's you can great. See, I know a few people who would love that. Yeah. Um. So if we we can follow on, so you follow me here. We're going. We're walking on top of the, uh, the um glass tunnel, as you can see. Underneath that glass tunnel, you can see the rail. Is going along there all the way down the avenue and uh, so come on with me arms and can we'll continue the tour here as we enter the avenue of uh, said <laughs> all right the two octopus octopi octopuses octopus eye octopi, octopi, yeah. it's nice when you're going through the tunnel underneath you can see the fish kind of uh, swimming above you, which is kind of cool. All right, so here we go. Here's the uh, the avenue. Now I had to go. As you can see here, these are jungle trees on the on the right hand side. These things, uh -huh. I had to. You might have heard me talking about jungle. Find the jungle. You told me. You told me you searched for jungle for 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 days. For days. For days. Absolute like days. I don't mean like days in Minecraft. I mean he searched for jungle for uh, for days in real life, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, for for days, days in real life, it it is like it is eight kilometers away, or sixteen depending on, you know, yeah, it's yeah, it's eight by eight, so it's sixty. Oh, the hypotenuse of eight by eight is about that much, that far away. You need to walk it in real time. And it, was that it's, just your spawn, the way that your world came together, or is that every world you have to I go have, for ages for jungle? If you look above there, uh, Mackenzie, you can see the uh, the entrance building that I designed and built myself. Oh yeah, there we go. How'd you like that? That's really cool. Yeah. Um, again, everything everything is built block by block, like you know, one on top of the next, and then that, and then to that, and then God. one, you know, and build it, then build it, and then I fell down many, many times building these things, and you got to get the different blocks and put them together. Right, so, hmm. Wow. Um, so what were you asking me there? Before we head on to the next piece? I uh, know. Uh, sorry, Mr. Hog. Uh, you continue with the tour. It was uh, I, I I can't even remember. No, no, Probably okay. not interesting. Right, okay. So, uh, uh, welcome down the, the welcome tunnel here. Come on down. So, things progressed and I hollowed out this entire tunnel here, uh, bit by Gosh. bit with my crappy little axe. And as you can see, I got kind of busy then after a while, and I built wow. a lot more. Wow. Oh my <laughs> gosh, you've got walls around it. Yeah. I built a lot a dog? of stuff. That's a dog. Yeah, some of my dogs. <laughs> yeah. Wow, look at the big waterfall. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, it's insane. <laughs> yeah. That's a little uh, um, <laughs> Took a while. Took a, took a long oh time. Oh my god. It's, <laughs> it, 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 it almost looks unreal. Ones. Like, yeah. I can't believe you built this block by block. I know. It was. It like, was if you like, told me, like, this is <laughs> always. Oh, the game comes like this. This looks like a computer game. Yeah, no, I had to, I had to build it. I built everything and designed it all, wrote it all down. You do need to plan it out before you build it, because you don't know what's going to fit where after you build like an eight by eight size Man, tower, eight. you know, such as this. Yeah, yeah, I had to well, plan it all out so that it fit in. Then by the time I went up that far, that it would then connect to it 
that thing. So what happened was I came around that corner there. Uh, I don't know if you can see, but I, I'll, I'll, shoot, I'll shoot an arrow. So I came out, see, I'm shooting this arrow over there, McKenna? Yeah. Down, I came around in that corner. I saw this mountain, which my castle now lays on top of. And I went, there's a nice yeah. little waterfall was falling down here. And I went, hey, that's great. A nice little natural waterfall into this natural little lake surrounded by kind of like higher kind of a valley, valley, valley lake. And then I said, I'm going to put my, I'm going to put my goddamn castle on top oh of my god this mountain. is insane and then it just kept on going so please you... join me for more of the Whoa. tour <laughs> as we go inside Whoa. the mountain if the tour had finished there i'd have been impressed so <clears throat> the, the mountain was yeah. went up and around here like so more or less uh, so i said why not hollow out that mountain a little bit and have the stairwell going all the way through the mountain so nice time nice time to enter uh go inside as the uh the light fades. So here we go. I would uh, not go in there, Gandalf. <laughs> yes. What madness brought them in here? <laughs> Try you fools. So here we go. So we got a nice little oh, bit of cave there. They another have a cave troll. Another, <laughs> another little dog for you there. Oh, that's your little doggy. Little dog, yeah. Um, that's cute. Yeah. So hollow this bad boy out. Put a little, few little candles out. You know, layered it up a little. This it's really of... cozy. I can hear oh, the fire can. crackling. Yeah, you can, can't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The fire's great crack. Uh, there's yeah, a nice little well. big ass fire. So the, uh, the stairwell goes up and left. So this, it both ends up in the same area. It just goes either side, you know, for a bit of class. Um, Money made so, a great point here. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Some yeah. freaking guy says this reminds me of the Sandcastle sketch. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> You're Follow. buying on the money. You're buying on the money. It is. <laughs> it is so like that. <laughs> and you going, oh, yeah, it looks it looks great. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Screw, screw you, man. Stop showing off. Um, so if we go up here and we have nice some uh, some nice armory things. Oh, so now uh, we're about to um, enter the nice little atrium here. Actually, do you know what we might do? Come down here. We'll sleep again, right? Because I think it's better showing you that in the light. So if you just follow me back down here again. Okay. Uh, what we'll do is um. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, buzzing. I should come out here. Come out here. Yeah. Okay. Come out here. All right. We're gonna. We're, that's the. Uh, that's the lane we came in through. Oh, it looks cool, lit up at night as well. It is quite nice. Yeah, yeah. So we're gonna go up this stair with it. Oh my god, you've got more dogs. This is kind of becoming a bit terrifying. <laughs> yes, there is a pack of them here. Yeah. I don't know. God, am I? Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's gonna so like just when you um, walk by. When you toggle them not to sit, then they follow you, and um, you're 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 uh, you're fairly fairly invincible on that point. As so you can see. Uh, as we go up, there's a nice little uh, wow. view. Jump in there. We'll make it a uh, daytime again. All right. So here you can see the. Uh, ooh, I'm very proud of that. That's this one here again. I'll shoot an arrow at it. Uh, uh, that one there. Quite proud of that that design there. I think some parts I, I took from other designs. Um, that people have uh, like. I think this, this this design here. I think is from a computer game. I think this this is tower that goes up here and across, but. Everything else is relatively mine. Well, it's Brunelleschi's dome. I have stolen his idea from Florence, but I thought, you know, that's a real Brunelleschi's world. dome. Yeah, oh yeah. my god, I can see it. Yeah, can you see it from in Florence? There, we we'll get a better view yeah. from up up, uh, up top. But uh, you can see it there. And um, uh, well, come on, come on inside, anyway. First, we'll go inside first. Brunelleschi's dome. You're like um, like Dubai, where you like build the the mimic. I jumped yeah. up and down. Oh yeah, if you, if you run down the stairs too fast, you'll uh, you will hurt yourself. Uh, again, I'm pretty bad at this place. Um, took me a long time. Again, it took me three and a half years to build this thing block by block. Uh, yes. Yeah. Stair block by stair block. Um, and, I mean, uh, that was way quicker than Bruno Leshi, though. In fairness. <laughs> yeah, it did take him. I think most of his life. All right, I'm on, I'm on up here. Now we're entering the atrium, which is Brunelleschi's dome. So here we go. Ta -da, ta -da, ta. Oh, cool. Yeah, a bit of stained oh, glass. Oh, this is, wow, this is cool. This is obviously where you hold court here. Mm -hmm. You decide on executions. No wonder there's nobody left <laughs> living in your in your of course. Minecraft village. You've killed them all. <laughs> no, Ooh. there were people, there were people, there were people. You, you idiot, you blew it all to hell. You blew it all to hell. Hey, aren't there Minecraft villagers? Didn't weren't there Minecraft villagers? Uh, yes, there there are Minecraft villagers. 
Uh, they or there are, were, obviously. They are, no, no, the village. I had to, I saved the village. I protected the village. I built a wall around it. Not a prison. It's not a prison. <laughs> it, 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 the wall is for protection. Their own protection. They need me. They need me to protect them. Um, so, uh, as you can see, um, so there's a nice bit of stained glass for the boys here. Uh, yeah, it's really nice. <laughs> yeah, as you can see, you can look out there. Uh, as you can see, the, the wall. The wall goes around. The wall took a long time. The wall did take a while. Yeah. It took a bit of... Um, oh, if you look down here, um, one bit of inspiration wow. I did take from Harry Potter Marble. was... Was, it was down here, um, Mackenzie. If you look down here, uh, the little... Uh, I kind of copied out the little uh, stairwell all the way down to the boathouse in... in... Um, in Harry Potter. So that goes all the way down there. So the, I kind of quite like that stairwell. So I wanted to kind of copy it going like meandering all the way down the mountain this oh, really yeah. kind of uh cobbled uh cobble line staircase so it goes up and around then and then into a little uh little boathouse here little cute you little have boat an house. unlocked full nerd <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah and then there will be a little boat there but i think it's, is there a boat in there oh, you can make a boat you can craft a boat anyway if you, if you really want to that's a furnace you see you put put stuff. You put in a bit of block of um, iron ore. You would you would you would uh, smelt down to uh, iron ingots and whatnot. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so there we go. The the wall. Oh my god, that took that took a while. And that wall is six deep. The wall is six deep. Um, <clears throat> that that like at that point, doing the wall was the only point where I felt I might be a bit. I might be a bit of a madman here. Um, like, why do I find this therapeutic? Um, oh, it that seems like so therapeutic. I, feel, I don't know what I was doing with my time, but clearly, like, nothing as creative as this. It's embarrassing. <laughs> Thank you. Um, just, just gold sketches. Just writing gold sketches. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> no one didn't write any sketches that year. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> Three years going, no sketches. <laughs> um, uh, of course, no, no, uh, no pass will be, be, uh, will be, uh, will be finished without a, a diamond throne. A uh, diamond and emerald throne. This, this of course, is a diamond block here. So if I, if I knock that out, uh, and then go back and pick it up, I want to pick it up because it's made out of nine diamonds. It'd be important. There it is. There. Uh, okay, so that is it, is it diamonds. Yes, block of diamonds. Yeah. You need, uh, I think it's sixteen diamonds to make a block of diamonds. Oh my god, I gotta steal the diamonds. I'll put it in there. <laughs> I can hear you. I can hear you. Hmm? Um, I, I can hear you. Here's a treasury here, so I shouldn't be showing you the treasury, but it's, but it's, it's over here if you want to see. See the treasury here. Um, that's right. Keep them good. Stuff. Oh, I've got some TNT as well, Mackenzie. I uh, I bagged a bit of TNT, so you know, you know we can do what we want with that later on. Um, oh, if you want to come out here, here's another little, small little bit inspired by uh, uh, Lord, uh, Lord of the Rings. So oh. you know, you'll probably see. I think it's like, you know, the you know the bit that juts out in that kind of. Um, is it Minas Tirith? You should. You you would know. You're, you're full. You're full. Lord of the Rings nerd. God, I used to know everything. Um, about everything, not just Lord of the Rings. I kind mm. of the people used to come to me from all different parts of the world to ask questions. I love um, how supportive Arms is. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's uh, how supportive. It sounds like you know, one wouldn't normally be supportive of of someone being so full nerd like this. You're doing so well, Sean. <laughs> Gondor, good man. You got it. You got it. Gondor, I think that's correct. Gondor. Yeah. Oh, someone, someone says Minas Tirith. I think it might be Minas Min Tirith. I think Gondor is the uh, I think, I think you're right, hole, it is Minas Tirith. Yeah, Gondor is a shithole that gets like, like, uh, gets, yeah, screwed up. So you see, Minecraft, it's quite pixelated up top, up front. But if you look out, uh, you know, there's the, uh, it looks quite beautiful. Oh, wow. So it takes, it's, it, Minecraft is so uh, memory intensive. It has to remember everything that's going on and everything is growing. And everything that's that you've built, or you got minecarts going hither and thither, that uh, that's remember a lot of stuff. And again, the the landscape keeps on going and changing, uh, and no Minecraft Minecraft world is the same. So you put in just put in your name as the name of Minecraft world. It will take that seed and then generate a whole different Minecraft world, uh, following all the Minecraft ru rules, but with that that individual uh, seed that is um, unique. So, uh, here we go. Um, onward with the tour. Enough, uh, enough nerd talk. Onward with the tour. Okay, so, we've seen this. Why don't we have a look around the wall a little bit? Uh, arms time. Oh, here's... Oh, yeah. a swimming pool. Swimming pool. Uh, no king would be... Uh, 
Uh, over here, you get a nice little stairs to our little swimming pool here. For you want a little dip, dip in your uh, little mar you? marble swimming pool. Uh, so you know, I think, I think it's, I think it's mostly uh, like this little this green kind of marble that I, I got. Oh, uh, did you lose me? I'm here. I'm I'm at the throne. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Sorry, my house is so big. I lose people all the time. <laughs> uh, so where, where where are you? Oh, there. You are. Okay. Uh, okay. Right. We'll we'll go outside. We'll go outside, uh, and we will uh, have a look from uh, from the wall. All right, da -da -da. that was quite proud of this this uh, building here. It was a nice little roofing kind of thing going on. If you can see this oh, and that thing there, quite proud of that little bad boy. Uh, if you look back at where we came from, I was very happy with this little uh, like aqueduct of a stairwell. You know what I mean? And if you look back, now you can see Brunelleshi's down there and all its kind of glory. It took a lot to find the clay to make the red brick for the roof. Do you know what I mean, Arms? Yes. And um, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta smelt that, you gotta dig it up from swamps. Oh, that, yeah. That's a trek. And I have to go back and back and forth and, and then carry it, transport all the, all the material back and forth. Um, but it is, it is very, um, Satisfying when then you build something to this scale and go, I built this, you know what I mean? There's only one yeah, of these no. in the world. Class. And it's all your own unique ideas. Like Minecraft is full it, the creativity is phenomenal. Like the, the scope of creativity. Like and the things that people have built, if you just do a quick like uh uh, uh oh why don't we have a romantic uh <laughs> romantic little sleep here? <laughs> I'm what I'm impressed about is like the like uh, you must get such satisfaction like I get satisfaction that like lasts for years from like a set of shelves or a cupboard that I've built <laughs> with instructions. This is like you didn't have any instructions. You've got to like build it from scratch. Yeah. And you have to make the stuff. <laughs> right, why don't we go for a little sleep here while we're waiting? Anyway. All, All right. right. Okay. Yeah. Let's go. Ahead. Jump in there. We'll make it a uh, daytime again. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. He's um. There we go. Yeah. Okay, right. Okay, well, I'll bring it over to the garden, huh? D d so there we go. I designed this little bad boy as well. I was quite happy with that one. L worked out well. All right, so we'll come on over to the garden here. Uh, oh, it's a nice little morning time. Good time to be, be looking at it. Oh, shift nice by the way is run. Shift is run. Yes, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Same way. I changed that. Oh, nice little possibly in there. Oh, no, let's leave it in. Sorry, we'll go down here. There's a little stairwell here. Yeah, right, nice sorry, one. sorry. There, there, there's a few snags. There's a few snag lists that need to be done. All right, here you go. So here's the garden. Um, um, welcome okay. to the garden here. As you can see, here's the garden. Oh here's yeah, garden. nice. There was a um, there was a natural uh, a pond of water up top on the mountain, and I took that and I aqueducted all the way down here because water in Minecraft just flows downwards, and it keeps flowing downwards at least seven blocks. Unless you stop oh, yeah. it, you obstruct it. It'll keep on going down if you keep on giving it space to fall down. So then it falls down, down, to, down, to, down to... The only pools. unfortunate thing with that meant that the water going into the village well um, was obviously dried up and... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> doesn't make sense. You don't get water into a well. Ruin my own joke. <laughs> okay, so um, that's that. Okay, so we can go back in the back entrance here. Uh... Uh, we'll go back. We'll uh, go back into the atrium this way. Um, again, people have built amazing things uh, in Minecraft. Uh, and it, like this the is creativity so is, is, is off. Can the you give me the so. server number, and I can just like come here, like chill, like on holidays. Mm <laughs> um, we'll have to think about having a special guest. Come You'll on. come back, and I've completely wrecked it. <laughs> You idiot! There's okay. zombies everywhere! Do you want to go up higher? Let's go higher, huh? Oh yeah, definitely. Let's go to the bedroom. And let's oh. have, check out the view from the, 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 the master bedroom. What's your weird big orb thing in the middle here? Oh, we need to go to... Sorry, where? where? There's a thing in the center of the room there, so you probably mentioned oh, this it before. Is, this is part of the narrative of the game. It's, the, it's called the beacon. Uh, oh. And... Uh, it uh it, it shoots in the sky you, you, when you uh when you fit there is a there is there isn't, isn't just building in the game there is like their narrative where you oh. have to find the stronghold inside the stronghold there is a um something else you need to defeat and get in order to 
bring you to a place called the end which is a place and you also have to go to hell which we will also be visiting um <clears throat> later on you just get stuff there uh and and craft things in order to find the next piece of the puzzle and then then the story comes um full circle uh when you do that okay so uh oh, oh Sadly, yeah, okay. this is the I just think we should note that this is the longest we've gone on the stream without dying so far. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. You I haven't know. even given you any armor. I'm sorry, I'm a very, a very poor host. Uh, so over here is the uh, is the way up to the... Again, a little bit of a snag list here. It doesn't look that pretty inside here, this particular... Uh, so you're going to have to... Uh, oh, it's class. You're going to have to jump up and, up and down here. Um, and Mackenzie, you have to mind, mind yourself that you don't oh, fall. Yeah. It's a little bit precarious. The like carpet's a, gorgeous. I will see the bedrooms. Okay, so. And then we'll go somewhere interesting. There are no, there are no handrails. There are no handrails. Okay, still, I'm mean, still going up. Oh, God, it's hey. absolutely cool. Cool. Let's go up here. Okay. How are we? Yeah, looking good. Yeah, looking right. good, yeah. Alright, cool. And we're into the master bedroom. Ta da! You're all very welcome to the master bedroom. Wow. Uh, <clears throat> it's really nice. Look at that four poster bed. Yeah, four poster bed. Yeah. Uh, what's, what is cool is uh, you've got a view then uh, for miles in either direction then. Uh, how would you get a wink of sleep with that view? <laughs> yeah, there's well, no curtains here either. Oh, there's a, oh, a little trap door here. Oh, yeah. I, I, yeah, be careful about falling down there. Yeah, but, yeah. Yeah, um, that was kind of a quick way of going down. I, I, there was a pool of water, uh, which uh, you fell directly down onto. It's obstructed at the moment, so you'll fall down onto that. Is that, what, what did I, what, is that, that dynamite? Switch, well, that switch, that switch uh, hits the, I think it hits the lights of when it's, uh, it oh, lights that's up. electricity, that red thing, is it? Uh, yeah, it, it lights up. I had to put wiring through the whole wall, so the whole <laughs> exterior wall goes all the way down from here. This is redstone here. So you put it down each, each bit by bit, and then that goes all the way down. Floor <laughs> bell. It's a floor bell. It's a floor bell. <laughs> the floor bell. <laughs> it's a floor bell. Uh, there's actually snow I'm covering some of that. So that's some of the white, but not all the white. Yeah, it is. <clears throat> um, oh, cool. So uh, you can't see it in the daytime, but at nighttime, if you hit that, then it will... Uh, I'm pretty sure it's still connected up. So you want to see uh, at the other side then? You can't see so yeah, this, is the, this is the way we came in. We should talk to you again. Again, you can press control and uh, you will not. Oh, wow. Uh, as um, you can see, it is kind of it's quite a, a beautiful view, you know, uh, on a macro scale. Uh, there's still lots more to show you. And uh, so you want to see uh, at the other side then? Okay. We should talk to you again. Well, there's Brunelleschi's dome, better view yeah. from up, up, uh, up top. But uh, you can see it there. and. Um, well, as you can see, it's a nice, very beautiful view, of course. So, uh, to the master bedroom. Uh, no king would be, uh, but if you look out, uh, you know, there's the, uh, it looks quite beautiful. Oh, wow. Uh, you know what I mean? Okay, so, we've seen this, uh, so, where, where, where are you? Oh, there you are. Okay. So, uh, here we go. Um, onward with the tour. do here is we're gonna plunge ourselves but we're gonna do it uh okay so so what we're gonna do here is uh okay uh okay you ready everybody <laughs> there we go all right we didn't die okay um so Okay, so the next place we did we to visit is we've seen above ground, but then mm -hmm. it is time to venture downward. <gasps> Down here. Oh my so, god. Oh no. Again, we have to dig this all the way out, stare yeah. it, light it. And I dug down here, I kept on digging, and then I came to a nice little Well, I came to here. This level That's here. Where you store your wine. I decided I'd hollow this to hell out. You know what? I'm not surprised there's a cat down here. In <laughs> hell. 
Well, this isn't hell exactly. This is just underground. You know what I mean? Oh, and no, not classically. Um, uh, so there was a natural cavern. As you see, if you come over here, there's actually a... This was a natural cavern underneath. So I decided I'd, I'd glass over the entire top of it. Uh, and uh, and then go ahead on either side then with the columns and just dig dig it all in a round square and then have the uh, as the natural cavern went diagonally from one corner to the next uh, and this is actually blue dyed glass uh, but I, no, it doesn't look as good as the clear glass because you actually see the lava so that's lava down there there's lava over here and I just kind of wow. digged it out and let it pour into the rest of it um, if I fell see. into the lava, would that be an issue? Oh, oh yeah, that'd be an issue. Yeah, we'd right. Last, we'd last two seconds in that, and you, la you do last, but not long. Very, not not long. Depends on how much armor you have on. Eh. And new lesson over in that one there. Uh, the, this is where over here was where the uh, the monsters. I created a monster machine. So to speak. <gasps> oh cool. my god, you're Frankenstein. Yeah. So you see in here, McKenna, there's bars, right? And there's a four yeah. by four square in there. And above us, Whoa. above us, there are chambers upon chambers. I've layered them of, oh. uh, of dark rooms where monsters this was, will this spawn. Was, this was here the last time. Yes, yeah, I think you saw this. This is one of the things I started with. Uh, that is a, 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 a creepy dude right outside. Yeah. Uh, we'll have to I can hear them. Yeah, let's go back. Um, so above us, again, Lots and lots of, of empty chambers, no light, so the monsters spawn them. They're, they are then funneled from that with water on either side into the middle chamber. They, come, they all fall down there, and then when they do, uh, I, they get crushed by a, uh, by, um, a, a redstone contraption that uh, um, just crushes them, basically. And then you get their their goods and their their experience points in there. Uh -huh. Nerdy McNerdy McNerdy. So there you go. <laughs> so that there's they're you good for getting uh, gunpowder and stuff like that and, and with a bit of gunpowder you can clear out more rooms. So on that note, follow me further. Well kill these pesky little dudes. Okay. So, so that I think you saw a little bit of this. Um but you definitely didn't didn't see um this uh this down here with what are you going to feed for? <laughs> um, you didn't see down here. I hollowed this entire place out myself from start to finish. Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> wow. Oh my god, there's villagers. No, no, it's a zombie. Uh, no, they are. Oh, there could be zombies down there. Wow. Actually, no, down there is the uh, the terracotta army I decided I would uh, uh, kind of resemble. As you can see down there, uh, built a little uh, near cross. Somebody there. wrote, so you did an automated torture machine. How cute. <laughs> it is It is exactly that. Well, it is an automated death machine. There's no torture involved, you know. Um, and then, so I hollowed out this entire cave mechanic, right? This entire, mm -hmm. took forever. Most of it I had to do manually. I didn't have the TNT for most of it. I had to do it bit by bit, and it took forever. And I, my plan was then to have an ancient, what looks like an ancient temple underground as if it was covered by like years and years of soil yeah. and, and sediment yeah. and whatever and it's only uncovered down here you know what i mean yeah um, kind of i can think it's inspiration for this kind of came from uh, uh would you believe it alien versus predator where they have <laughs> they have the uh, uh the um the mayan tomb no the um the, the inca temple the inca kind of step temple and then they have it like this kind of hidden underground and then the archaeologists find this i thought that'd be, that'd be a neat idea and of course this is a another monster machine so as you can see the creepers come down here and then uh, they die on the uh on the um, on the lava uh, again it's a very complicated contraption the water funnels them down there uh, from drops them out there they go down here and around wow. in the water and they drop it here. It's kind of Indiana Jones or something. That's here. what it reminds me of. You can pick up all the, uh, the gunpowder. Uh, yeah. yeah, it is a bit Indiana Jones, -y, yeah. Yeah, isn't yeah. it just? So this, I was very happy with this design. All the quartz I had to find, all the white marble is very hard to, to find. You need to gather it and put it together in the nether. So that brings us to the next part.
of our oh. tour. The Nether. Follow me! Follow me, I feel like this is the crystal maze. Come you, on! I can't believe that you did all this in survival mode, so if you don't know what survival mode is, um, basically there's like a creator mode, which is essentially like, you get access to all the equipment and all the stuff, and you just kind of like, as if you had all the bricks in Lego. But this is um yes, this there is something two, different. Two different modes. There is creative and the survival mode. And I've only ever played one game in survival mode, this game here. So you can die at any moment. And you do come back, but you lose everything you had. You lose all your equipment, all, all the stuff, all everything in your inventory, and you go back to wherever you started. So you could be in a very awkward place and you have to travel for miles and miles to get back. So it's the kind of is the de is the is the trade off there, unfortunately. Alright, so um Okay, so that was the uh, underground cave, I guess, um, with the ancient. Yeah, tower. that's class. Um, I think you'd done a bit of that when I when I first saw it. I think so. I think I digged out a little bit, yeah, but but not yeah. a, not a whole ton. That's right. You had yeah. this room here with yeah. the. I remember. Okay. Okay. You d yes. 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 I did. I showed you this. Yeah. yeah. But you got rid of. You had this like structure that you hated. There was like a oh, one I of did. the first things you'd built. Oh, it was some, terrible. Like, oh, I, white I blew it up. tower or something. Yeah, I blew it up. And you hated it so much and, and you were showing it to me and you're like, stop looking at it, it's disgusting. And I was like, it looked pretty good to me. Oh, it looked but like a Christmas blew tree. It up. No, it looked like a square Christmas tree. It was horrific. Yeah, I blew it up I, and I redesigned it. Oh, what is the beautiful atrium again? Oh, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, that's really nice. Um, so out here, if you can follow me out here. I can't believe this, there's still more. But wait, there's more. Oh, wait, there's more. So again, there's there's the front where we came in. Jump up. And, yeah, happy with that. But up here, right, this this was the place of the first kind of little structure that I built. Um, and uh, as you can see now, it's a nice little kind of rustic, you know, um, medieval looking terror. But inside here is the portal to hell. Uh, you can make one by um, digging down to the the, the depths of uh, of um, of the overworld, finding this this material which is called uh, uh, netherrack or something. Uh, anyway, and um, and uh, and then um, you got it, you light it on fire, and then as you can see, you can hear those sounds. So if we uh, if we jump up and, and then sit on it, I've never gone into it with with two people at the same time. It's only just been me. In case okay, so you jump into it, there, and stay in it, right? And you'll see that er, okay. the, everything's fading, kind of kind of going weird. Yeah. Yeah. yeah? And then yeah. we'll end up. And now, are we in hell? Are we? Yeah. 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 And I have to get out of it. So jump out of it there. Jump out. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. So now we're in. And now we're basically, basically in hell. So if uh, you got to be careful around here now, right? So uh, just be. be oh be, yeah. Be, well, be careful. we are in hell. Yeah, so just, just watch your step, like. Yeah, do, do watch your step, okay? So we're now in hell. Okay, um, come out there. Uh, okay, and uh, so as you can see, uh, hell. Hell's quite. Oh quite my hellish. god, the floor is lava. The do floor, I have a lava suit? Can I run over that? Lava. Um, so, like, if you look down here, there are. It's kind of beautiful. Oh, did, oh yeah, that's not you. Um, you can see there is a lakes. There is lakes of fire. Lakes of fire. Oh, um, yeah. And. Uh, it does get it is, it's kind of beautiful um in a way oh, oh what's that a railway going all the way through the nether through a sea of fire yeah what maniac must have built that <laughs> so, where did you go this is as far as i go we obviously attracted him okay um oh there he is okay right, um yeah probably best to best to get inside if you can't see he doesn't shoot you all right so that's that that's hell it um it uh, there's there's a lot a lot more to it but um it's vast and expansive what we could do um, I guess what we could do is we could take the uh, the monorail. Um, will it be hard to get back? Maybe. Okay, you know what? Why don't you why don't you go first, Mackenzie? And this should work. Okay, jump in there, okay. and we're basically going to do before you go head off there. Um, what's happening here is we're going to do a. Um, it's going to be a roller coaster through hell. Is is essentially what I've built all the way through hell. Now it goes for a long while. But we'll, so we'll come back. But the, the first bit is quite fun. So why don't you, why don't you, head on, up, head on up there, and I'll, I'll follow behind you. Cool. Uh, <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> and it lands. 
lands under the tra under the rail. Just on that deck, that base. Break the track, I'm not sure. Oh, there is a break the track, okay. I'll have to be careful here. You're in it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sorry, turn on you in your own in your own vid, in your own haste. <laughs> Sound glitches, I think, with uh, when you get in this really loud minecart. Um, so we're coming to the end of the tour now. Nice bit of hell there for you. Ain't it beautiful? Mm-hmm. What's your um? What's your uh, favorite part of this? What's the part you like the most? Um, I, I would say uh, the. the the place I'm most proud of, I guess, is the, uh, uh, is, uh, um, the, the, the underground cavern. How I built and designed that, I think, is the place I'm most proud of. Um, and, uh, and the outside, the overall kind of outside. Uh, yeah. Um, I mean, the building it was, was like, it was great, great. It was fully great. I would recommend this game to anyone because of creativity. I would recommend it to their kids, at least. Um, if you do have kids. Okay, I'm coming back, I'm coming back. Uh, goodbye, Nether. Hello, overworld. <clears throat> um, yeah, the, the creative like potential is amazing. Some of the stuff that people have built um, in Minecraft, is going to YouTube, but they've built the city of like of New York to scale, you know, meter by meter. Ah, for some reason, that doesn't interest me as much. No, it's yeah, it's not as creative because it's just a copy. Um, well, yeah, like, like I mean, it's definitely it's, impressive. Yeah, but, but like, then... Uh, and other things, you know, people have done like this. They've gone the wrong way, and they've built um, they've built uh, their own stuff. Okay, so um, uh, is there anything else? There is. Wow, I'd imagine this is very therapeutic to do. Did yeah. you already say that? Yeah, yeah, it it can be quite therapeutic. Yeah, like you certainly like you know when you're mining. There's one other place I'm gonna I'm gonna show um, the boys and girls, uh, which is uh, the mine. So. In order to um, to to get all the materials, so I took all the materials I dug out here and I used it in the wall. And like you know, you go along and this isn't stone, this is dirt. Uh, but you would go, you you, you build it bit by bit, bit, and you go along, do the next layer, along, 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 and so on and so forth. But you got to get that stone here, and I got it from digging out here. So, uh, but my mines are how the hell am I? My initial mines, I went down, you see, to find diamonds, you want to go get diamonds, so, diamonds are, uh, are, Girl's best friend? Are, well, for, uh, uh, I was going to say forever, but, uh, uh, go down here, I think they are down here, I can't remember, it's so long since I've been down here, oh no, I know there, this, this is the bottom of the cavern here, um, just, not that it's, not that it's uh, particularly impressive or anything like that, but it's just uh, interesting in terms, from the game, kind of playing the game, uh, perspective. Uh, I know it's all very blocky. It looks quite the same down here. God damn it! Again, snag list. Um, no, it's over. Where are we? Yes, here. These. This is where I would go down to the mines. And um, right, right. Where are you? Where did they go? Again, it's been so long. I uh, I can't remember. I thought they were here. Ah, here you go, here you go, right, so, this goes down, so this is like, uh, if, you, if I check, like, level, I'm at uh, level, you can see the X and Y, in the middle there you see X, Y, Z, and then the Y is, we're 30, 30 high right now, um, so, I know it's getting strange. That's the bad again. news, I died again. Oh, oh, were you making your way back again? Oh, sorry. Um. Okay, so we're going down now, and we're going down to the... You'll see the bedrock now where Minecraft doesn't go any further. It goes out infinitely on either side. So what you do is you dig down and then you hollow out mines like for ages. So you want to find diamond, you want to find iron ore, you want to find redstone, you want to find lapis lazuli and sapphire and emerald and all this stuff. And you you build these sh mine shafts. Uh, it is called Minecraft and they, they go on for a long, long while. But uh, and these are all man-made by me but there are natural caverns that you do 
come across every so often like stuff like this and then other gigantic ones that open up uh, in huge giant underground caves like uh, if I keep going I'm sure I'll find one um, and then also abandoned mine shafts that are just littered throughout the game underground in completely random spots are you killed by a spider? Uh, again, I don't even know where I am now. But I've got a minecart so I can get back. Wow. Um, oh, let me just do this. Oh, I think I know it. Oh, this is going somewhere cool. This is going somewhere very cool. I've just remembered. I created something very cool. I created a massive big fall from the top of the world. Here we go. Yeah. All right. This is going to be a bit of crack. There's going to be a lot of crack here. Okay. Um, you see, I, I, I created a massive big plunge pool. Yes, that's right. And then here, ah. and a yes, ah yes, I did. I created there's, there's a yeah, pool of lava, and I, I built, I hollowed, I pushed it all back, and then built this. There's a layer of water down there. This is gonna get cool. Absolute nightmare. <laughs> yeah, well it's calming in a way. I mean yes, it's dangerous, but there's a beauty in the danger. Uh, this is water, and where water meets the lava, you can see underneath this, it creates that material, which is the material you need to make the portal to help. Makes sense, right? Uh, arms, you died again, did you? No! Oh, you killed something! Okay, so, the cool thing about what, what I'm about to show you now is, there's a stairwell, and it goes all the way to the top of a mountain outside of um, our... Um, uh, a mountain outside of our uh, castle. If I go all the way up it, it goes so we're falling through a mountain. I hollowed it all out. We're falling through a mountain, through where the ground would normally be, because that's been hollowed out too, and then into a plunge pool of water. So I would definitely imagine it would be the biggest um, <laughs> man-made dive. I don't think it'd be quite regulation. I think health and safety would have would have a thing or two to say about this uh, particular construction. Um, health and falling, safety, there now. Are falling a good hundred meters. You do tend to survive that. I wouldn't recommend this in real life. We do need to say that uh, as an FYI uh, to the stream. Um, just casually digging through a mountain. <laughs> Indeed. Um, Head and safety, there now. Okay, so yeah, we've made it there. So if I, so it's, as you can see, it's, it goes down for a bit. Let's let's drop a drop a coin, huh? <laughs> I don't hear it fall! It means it's deep. Okay, here we go. Alright, so, uh, yeah, and then there's a, there's, there's the, so there's the plunge bill. There it is right there. So it's right in the center of, of the, uh, of the falling. So, as you can see, now, it's still, uh, nighttime here, you can see our, uh, but right over here, where it's on a mountain, right outside the castle, as you can see there. I'm gonna take a little, little screenshot, huh? A little screenshot to remember the day by. Very good. It's daytime no, now, so you, I can come get you now. There's no mine curse. I can there come is get a you. horse. I can uh, I can come get you, and there's a way I can go that I can show people a few more things as we go. So, for example, so this is as you can see. Oh, lovely little morning there. Oh, oh, how oh how tasty is that? Oh, the sunlight. Oh, the shards of light. <laughs> of course, beautiful. Um, Oops. Oh, floating island. That does tend to happen the odd time in Minecraft. Um, it's not a glitch, it's just kind of a problem with the code. You know what I mean? Um, best friends forever. F Arms from Fat has made the advance of best friends forever. Um, I thought we already were best friends. Okay, so. Um, I think it's it's your horse. Oh, okay, so you are on the horse. Good man. Can then come well, on. I don't know how to drive him. Drive him. Drive okay, horse. if you, uh, you'll know your direction if you press F3. I didn't think it would take this long, but this is actually so much to show you. And I don't know how to, how to make the horse do what I want it to do. Not like a mind control sense, just like... Okay, well, I, I, can, I can come get you now anyway, so... Uh, uh, but there is something cool that I have... Uh, oh, as you can see, the wall goes all the way around. Uh, it's pretty well. Um, it's layered. Uh, oh, God. Okay, let's go around. Uh-huh. Okay, go around here. Uh-huh. There's more shards of light. So yeah, that wall, that wall took a goddamn age. It's six deep and it's it's um it's hollow in parts, but mostly it's not. And it's layer upon layer. Okay, so 
Oh no, how am I gonna get in? Oh no. Oh dear. It's the ugh. Oh. Oh what's what's this button? Oh, it's not a button. I mean <laughs> what's what what's this? What's this button? <laughs> yeah, look, it's a secret little passageway, huh? <gasps> you like that? Oh my god. So that's a bit of wiring I had to do to uh to get that um to get that uh, working. So as you can see, this little bad boy um, it closes, you see, and it it pushes pistons on the other side. You have to, to uh, you see, you'll see the wiring here if I. Uh, as you can see, there's, there's the pistons, it goes all the way through there, there's wiring on either side of that then, and then you cover it over then with blocks. Uh, and then, hey presto, it's a, it's a Minecraft uh, little secret, uh, secret drawbridge. So, the stairs is always there, it's just the, um, the pistons that cover it and push the other blocks to cover it, you see? Oh, there we go. And uh, then we are back. <laughs> Uh, back in the uh, the main courtyard where where uh, the lake as you can see there we go. Actually, this is something I'm most proud of. This was incredibly hard to design. It was, you wouldn't believe how hard it is to create a, not just spherical, but an elliptical roof out of squares. And squares aren't have... round. And I figured that out the hard way. And trying to make, so there's only a certain configuration that will look uh, elliptical from a distance if you arrange them in a certain way. Uh, and uh, so I had to draw that out and like um, it was um, it's been a whole night just drawing it trying to figure out where to put the put the blocks and space in it what would make a a, a uh, an elliptical dome when it connected up anyway, boring but uh, took a long time all right where are you there you are okay let's go we're gonna go to that mountain and we're gonna do that plunge build thing I thoroughly enjoyed it. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna see up here in the distance, Mackenzie. Uh, a fire and arrow at it. Oh yeah, up, up there. That's Looks kind of like, like a like a ruined chapel, like kind of like this kind of thing. I was yeah. Where, uh, we're gonna go up to that, right? So uh, I guess we can jump off onto this tree here. It's probably the easiest. Okay, you're good. You're good. Okay. Oh, we're going tree hopping. Okay, I'm gonna. Jumping off, take yeah, yeah. this hole. The farthest you can basically jump in Minecraft. Yeah, go for it. Can't go wrong. Wow. <laughs> wow, that was cool. <laughs> Good stuff. All right, and here we go again. All right. Da -da -da. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's cool. I can see you come closer. Oh, oh, could hey, you? <laughs> daddy. <laughs> okay, well, I guess that that is the uh, the end of the stream, guys. Is that, that's pretty much all I got to show you. That's pretty much the um, the creation that I made, and um, I guess we'll uh, we'll leave it there. Uh, yeah, no, <laughs> I, I really enjoyed it. It was as big a surprise for me as it was for you. 
Um, I don't know how he did it. <laughs> we're so busy all of the time. I really don't know where he even found the time. Yeah, well, like I um, said, it's quite uh, it's quite therapeutic. Like, you just, you just chill out. Yeah. So, something to do before you go to bed and all that, you know. There you go. Yeah, well done. Yeah. <clears throat> sure. Um, all right. Okay, well, um, thanks very much, guys. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.